my dear students now we will see about hybridization in plants <coughs> it is the third method followed in the conventional plant breeding method first method plant introduction second method selection this is the third method hybridization hybridization is a process of crossing two plants together with a, unlike genetic constitution to get hybrid superior quality hybrid or hybrids and that is the hybridization when two plants with uh, unlike genetic constitutions are crossed together and that process is called hybridization it is a crossing between the two plants with uh, two different genetic constitution and that process is called hybridization the result of hybridization is the development of hybrid suppose for example a plant is crossed with b plant will get c plant c plant is the hybrid so it is a process of producing hybrid by crossing two plants together these two plants are genetically unlike genetically different unlike genetic constitution they have this is hybridization the hybridization is a method it is a method in order to increase the improvement in plants it is the only method to combine all the desirable character from the plants one or two plants collectively into one individual so this is the best method in order to collect all the desirable characters to combine all the desirable characters into one individual there are several plants by means of crossing the desirable character good characters they are all combined and that can be generated in one plant that is the main advantage of this hybridization the natural hybridization was absorbed by cotton mather he only first observe natural hybridization in plants first person cotton mather was the first person to observe the natural hybridization in plants so that is the things next uh, there are steps followed in hybridization steps followed in hybridization number 1 selection of the parents selection of the parents is first emasculation emasculation is the second method third one bagging fourth one crossing the fifth one is the harvesting of the seeds and 
and rising the crops. These are all the five methods. Five methods follow in hybridization. First method is selection of the parents. Second one is emasculation. Third one is bagging. Fourth one is crossing. Fifth one, harvesting of the seeds and raising the seeds. The first two method, selection of the parents, male parent and female parents with desirable characters, good characters are selected, should be selected. And that is the selection of the parents and uh, those parents, male parent and female parent should be tested with uh, tested for homozygosity. Homozygosity, homozygosity means presence of alike uh, leaves for a particular gene in the individual. That is the homozygosity that we have to select. We have to test whether they have desirable characters, such as parents should be selected. So selection of best parents for crossing, for hybridization, that is the selection of parents. The second process is emasculation in hybridization technique. What is emasculation? Emasculation is a process of removal of anthers to prevent cell pollination before anthesis. So when you remove all the anthers from the flowers of your plant before anthesis, anthesis means during the period of opening of your flower that is called anthesis. During the opening of the flower, the collection of all the stam uh, all the stamens should be there. The stamens should be removed from the flower in order to make it as a female flower in the bisexual flower. So that is emasculation. The third one is bagging. After emasculation, the stigma of the flowers of the particular plant should be covered with polythene bag in order to protect against any undesirable pollen grains. So that is the bagging. So the fourth one is crossing. After that only you have to cross two plants together. What is crossing? When the pollen grains are collected from the male plant and dusted on the stigma of the female flower, female parent, female flower of the female parent, that is called crossing and that uh, fourth process. That is the fourth process. Fifth one, harvesting of the seeds and raising the crops or plants. After that, after the formation of the seeds, all the seeds should be collected. The pollination leads to the fertilization after that, after fertilization, seed formation will be taking place. After the formation of the seeds, the seeds should be collected. <coughs> and from the seeds, new hybrids, new plants will be produced. And this is the method of hybridization. The five methods are followed in hybridization process. First one, selection. Second one, emasculation. Third one, bagging. Fourth one, crossing. Fifth one, harvesting of the seeds. So that is about the techniques involved in hybridization. Now we we'll pass on to types of hybridization. There are several methods followed in the types of 
uh, hybridization. First one, intravarietal hybridization. Intervarietal hybridization, intergeneric hybridization. The third one is interspecific. Fourth one is intergeneric hybridization. So there are four types of hybridization. One is intravarietal hybridization. Second one is intervarietal hybridization. Third one is interspecific hybridization. And fourth one is intergeneric hybridization. First one is intravarietal hybridization. Here it is a crossing between the plants of the same variety. When two plants are crossed together with the same variety, that is called intravarietal hybridization. This is very useful in self pollinated crops. Intervarietal hybridization is the second one, intervarietal hybridization. In the intervarietal hybridization, Two plants are crossed together with the two different varieties of the same species. When two plants which differ in two, which, uh, which will be from two different varieties of the same species, that is called intervarietal hybridization. What is intervarietal hybridization? When two plants of the two different varieties of the same species are crossed together, that is called intervarietal hybridization. They are, this, uh, this crossing is useful both in self pollinated as well as in cross pollinated plants. The third one is interspecific hybridization. The interspecific hybridization, it is a cross between the plants of two different species. It is a cross between the two plants of the two different species that is called interspecific hybridization. It is commonly used for transferring genes of disease, insect, pest and drought resistance from one species to another species. The disease resistant gene should be transferred, can be transferred from one plant to another plant, from one species to another species, or insect resistant gene can be transferred from one species to another species, or pest resistant gene can be transferred from one species to another species of the plant, or the drought resistant character of the gene can be transferred from one species to another species. For example, Gossypium hirsutum is uh, crossed with Gossypium arboreum. you will get disease resistant or pest resistant or insect resistant or drought resistant plants you will get as the hybrid. 
So this is the best method in order to transfer G for disease resistant or insect resistant or pest resistant or drought resistant can be transferred from one species to another species. In the intergeneric hybridization, there are three disadvantages for this disadvantage. The first disadvantage, hybrid sterility. Hybrid sterility will be possible. Second one, it is a time consuming process. And the third disadvantage is uh, expensive. It is an uh, expensive procedure. So these are all the three disadvantages. <coughs> <coughs> disadvantage of <coughs> this inter generic hybridization. First one, hybrid sterility. The hybrid may become sterile, will not produce the new offspring and that is the sterility, sterility of the offspring, the hybrid sterile. Hybrid sterility, hybrid becomes sterile. Time consuming, it will take longer time to achieve the expected result. It is an expensive procedure. It is a very expensive procedure. This is all the disadvantage of intergeneric hybridization. That's all about hybridization.